If you want to buy cheap Fallout 76 items fast and safe, then check out EasyNPC.com and make sure to use my discount code DEMON for 5% off your entire order. A link is in the description below. What's up guys, Demon Asylum here with a new Fallout 76 video in which I'll be showing you all an easy glitch to get unlimited fusion cores. If you guys do go on to enjoy this video or find it helpful, I'd really appreciate it if you took a second to drop a like on it and subscribe if you haven't already. I also have a great Discord server about all things Fallout 76 that I'd love to have you guys join. If you're interested the link is in the description. So a quick note about this glitch, I'm sure there are at least some of you that have known about it for however long, but please understand that it's not out there that much, and so the majority of people likely don't. Just because it isn't new to you, doesn't mean it isn't new to anyone else as well. Anyway, to get started with this glitch, you're going to want to load into a public adventure server. I've tried this on private servers, but the noticeably less lag seems to make it impossible. Once you're loaded into the game, head to the White Spring Resort, and more specifically where my arrow on the map is at, this location. Once you're there, you'll recognize it as the location in my video here, if you're not already familiar with the place. In this area, you'll see two sentry bots. What you want to do is get up close to them, kill them, and then immediately spam whatever button or key you'd press to start looting items off of them. I even start spamming it right before I kill them, and that's probably your best bet too. Depending on how much lag there is in the server, you could have anywhere from just a second up to a few seconds to loot the guaranteed fusion core that they'll drop. If you don't get it quick enough, then you'll notice it just disappears from the list of what the sentry bot dropped. It's worth noting that it is possible to get into a public server with not enough lag to do this glitch, but it seems rare based on my testing, so the majority of servers you should be good. Moving on, once you've collected the fusion core from the sentry bot immediately after killing it, take a step back as it will blow up soon after. Once it's blown up, you want to go back to its body and you'll notice that it once again has the same loot on it that it just did right after killing it, including another fusion core. Loot the sentry bot for the second time now and there you go. You've quickly gotten two fusion cores from it and can rinse and repeat the process on the other sentry bot as well as then just server hop to do this whole process again. That's going to be it for this video though guys. If you have any questions or concerns, just post them in the comments and I'll do my best to get back to you as soon as I can. As always, if you've enjoyed or found this helpful, be sure to drop a like down below, subscribe for more, and click the bell icon to be notified when I post new videos. Thanks for watching everyone, and have a great day.